Heavy metal, heavy oh. metal, mm. and heavy metal. We are Devil You Know. I'm Ryan, I play bass. I'm Francesco, and I play guitar. I'm Howard, I play juice harp, and also sing. <laughs> I'm John, I play drums. <laughs> I should be playing the didgeridoo, right? <laughs> this guy went to school for music, and this guy barely went to school. And... Yeah. <laughs> Collectively, we could all agree on bands like Pantera, Metallica, Anthrax, all of the, the big ones. I started getting tattooed at around 16 years old. Uh, I had a friend who was not good at tattooing and he wanted to learn. My first tattoo was a you know, sweet tribal piece. But then, uh, and plus I started going to hardcore shows and pretty much every band you saw the, the tattoo. Yeah, we started with the shoulder. And just, I don't know, I guess it was the first tattoo. We just like wanted to go small and then uh, as soon as they got it, I felt like I wanted more. And now I, I always liked tattoos. I'm no good with the pain at all. Obviously I like the end result, but it wasn't really until I, uh, I guess I found something that I really wanted and was going to be committed to getting it. We were actually on tour in Europe and we went to Auschwitz in Poland. It was actually in, uh, in the concentration camp in one of the barracks. And when I got home and was going through the photos, I was like, wow, that's really cool, you know. And I just liked the design. That day was a pretty intense, emotional kind of day, I guess. My hands are completely done by Dan Smith. They were supposed to go somewhere else, uh, but we just did them on my hands instead. And then I've got a, a bass clef and a treble clef on my thumbs. I've got almost every Descendants album cover tattooed on my leg. The story goes, I was planning to get both legs done, and once I got this done, I was like, no way in hell am I going back to get the other side done. So I just started on everything else, and uh, you know, maybe one day I should probably uh, go and get something done on that one. I had uh, Jim Miner do a Virgin Mary playing an upright bass on here. Uh, Dan Smith did uh, The Devil Went Down to Georgia. And then I've got Daniel Albrigo, has got my rat fink and my heart. And then Lindsey Carmichael did the top of my shoulder. So the writing, actually, I can kind of pronounce it. It's uh, Ji Fon Shin Lei, and it's like it's from a very old poem. The meaning is as fast as lightning, I and mean, it's got flames. I'm a guitar player, so it's kind of perfect. So basically the idea was, uh, you know, to kind of have like something that would represent the uh, natural elements and uh, the typical like Japanese devil mask and looks really cool, really pissed, but at the same time it doesn't have any evil meaning. It fits. The initial idea with the heart was because I have religious pieces on my sides, we discussed maybe doing a centerpiece and maybe like a sacred heart and I really didn't want that old school style. I have no regrets whatsoever and uh, I will probably get more in the future.